Hi, I'm She Who Wanverse, also known as Poetic Dreams or Tough Girl, depending on how you know me. This is my very first video, so bear with me. I'm not a pro at it. But this is a video response to Susie Blue, also known as Suzanne Pepe. And I'm um, going to mention Kelly Norris as well. I'm going to go ahead and give the credits out so no one gets sl feels slighted that they got didn't get acknowledged. Susie was informed by Kelly that a woman used her images in a, in a video on YouTube. And instead of it, it's Susie being kind to this woman and explaining copyrights to her or, um, you know, messaging her privately, she blasted her. Uh, she left her a nasty comment on her on her uh, YouTube channel. I don't care what anybody says. The little Susie followers can say it wasn't nasty. It was nasty. It was intended to be. You know, when you ask people for royalties that, you know, the way she did, that was nasty. This woman, after Susie did that, Susie made a blog, Susie made a video, and her little banshee people, as I like to call them, they're not groupies, or other people call them groupies, went and harassed this woman. First clue, that's cyberbullying. All y'all were bullies to this woman, okay, and that wasn't nice. You made her shut down her YouTube channel. And you can say you didn't make her. You did. For you to keep going to her channel and, and verbally bashing her and leaving comments like y'all did, that's bashing. That's, that's cyberbullying. She shut it down. Now, Susie also made a few comments about this woman's work. And I'm going to quote Susie because Susie's got a thing about wanting credit where credit's due. She said, if we leave it up to this lady, we will all make inauthentic shit. Okay. She called this woman's work crap. Okay. And that's not the first time Susie's called other people's work crap. Okay. You know, everybody's entitled to their opinion or it is in the eye of the beholder. Okay. And, um, you know, that's all well and good. But she didn't have to post it like she did. Susie also, in her video, in her blog, and I'm quoting, said, I am respectful to people even when I'm pissed off. You can't be respectful and be pissed off at the same time. They don't go hand in hand. You can be rude and pissed off, and that's what you were. It said, she also said, if you are posting something in a public forum, then you must be accountable to answer to the public. And she also said, there is something sinister in doing everything behind closed doors and giving a different face to the public. I can't do that and I won't, unquote. Susie darling, you're two-faced. I'm just putting it out there, make, you know, acknowledge it, accept that you're two-faced. Behind closed doors, you talk trash about Jared, Gary, Million, Willowing, just to name a few. And then you're talking sweet about Jared on your latest video. That's if you still have it up. Because you're known to take videos down if people mention a certain video, like Ch -ch changes where Volva Love was mentioned. You, that, you send people that follow you over to other people to bash them, to do your dirty work, like you did Marilyn and Sonny. Don't say you don't send people to bash other people. Okay, they do it on their own. When you make a video and you make a blog, you're telling people, in your own words, how pissed off you are, they shouldn't do this. That was wrong. Da da da. They're gonna get on your little gypsy bag wagon and haul their butt over there and start trashing them. Okay. So you're responsible for that. Okay. I'm putting it out there right now. Don't nobody go trash Susie. This is between me and Susie right now, and I'm good with it because I don't hate her. I don't dislike her. I'm just trying to enlighten her yet again. Friends are there for you, Susie. They don't go out of their way to bring controversy to your door. What Kelly did was not being your watchdog, okay? You're the dog because she fed you a bone and you gnawed the hell out of it. You know, you didn't give it up. What Kelly is, you know, credit. Get, get your credit, Kelly. You're a puppet master. You pulled the strings. Susie danced her little jig for you, and you got entertained. And you need to cut the strings, Susie. You need to take care of your own business. Quit letting Kelly tell you so-and-so slighted you. You know, that's grade school stuff. You know, get, get over it. You're 45 years old. You know, you say she took your work. 
Okay, I'm not saying she was right in what she did, but you took other people's work and you're getting paid for it. You admit on your video for your portrait class that you went on Google and you gleaned people's ideas and now you're making money out of portrait class. Okay? You're also making money off the goddess and poet class and you're also making money off of the little red riding hood and wolfie. Hi, those are my ideas. Where are my royalties? Where's my money? Send a sister some money, girl, because I'm poor just like you. Economic times are kicking everybody's butt. Send my money. You know, I, I'll send you my PayPal account. Send it on. Because in chat, you asked all of us, Sonny and Marilyn and Camille and I, what will we do to run an in-group? What, what will we teach? I mentioned quilts. I mentioned fabric I mentioned poetry and I mentioned dolls now I didn't go after you like you did this girl and all she did was take your pictures and put them in her personal book you're making money off of my ideas and Sonny's and Marilyn's and everybody else's you may f you you make friends and you get their ideas and then you do away with friends and anybody who follows you this you know I'm just calling you out to help you change your ways, not to bash you. I'm just trying to enlighten you. You made friends with Julianne, Ka uh, Katie Lynn. You know, now we don't hear about Julianne, Katie Lynn no more. I mean, I heard a snide comment you made, but any I don't teach backgrounds because anybody can make backgrounds. No offense, Julie can make some kick-ass backgrounds. I'm sorry. I'm you know, no, I'm not sorry. That girl can make some kick-ass backgrounds, and she deserves credit. You know, you keep doing your thing, Julie. Rock on. Everybody makes art their own way. You don't like my art. I don't like your art. Becky don't like your art. I don't care. Your art is a dime a dozen, honey. I can hit that internet and find you anywhere. You want to know why? Because you taught people how to make your image with a template. You also gave them face dimensions. And as long as they were putting the dollar right here in your hand, they could make that picture all they wanted. Make all the La Petite dolls you want. Don't sell them after class. Once class is over, it's null and void. I take everything back. It's mine. I own it. Okay? You don't own it. If they're making it, it's theirs. Okay? You may, you know, you copyrighted your image. That's fine. You don't want it out there. Quit teaching them how to make it identical to you. I know there are plenty of classes out there. Julie's not teaching people, here's how you make this background. Julie's saying, these are the colors I used. This is, you know, what I did to make this background. She's not saying, you know, this is the proportions and this, you know, make the eye dreamy or whatever it is that you teach people. You put it out there, people are going to use it. I'm not saying this right. My poetry's flying around the world right now. People are claiming it's theirs. I'm not going to go dog them for it because at the end of the day, what's it going to do? It's not going to make me happy hurting another person. Maybe that's just my soul speaking. Maybe you don't have a heart and you like being mean to people. Okay? I don't think so. I think deep down you want friends. But you're getting all the wrong people, hon. You're not getting people. You had good people who were there for you. And you used them. And then you threw them away so you can start a new class. And you knew if these people stayed in your life, that they were going to say, hey, hey, Susie's teaching a class that I told her about. That's not cool. You're no different than that woman taking your pictures and pasting them in her art journal. In fact, you're worse because you're making money off it. And that woman didn't profit off that video. She was just sharing what she liked to do with the world for somebody who could have been depressed, Susie, and saw the video and said, I, I, I can make art. You crushed that woman's soul. And that's just mean. And I don't think that's right. I welcome your Banshee people to come to my YouTube. I'm She Who Wanders. Get that right. Because I, I don't want you to miss me. Say what you want to say about me. Talk about how I, you know, speak. You know, joke me. I don't care. I'm not going to delete my hate comments. I'm going to leave them up there. I just want you, Susie, to learn. To, to not hurt other people. Okay? Send them my way. I know you won't like my opinion in your blog about it. But get my oral right, girl. Okay? Send the sister her money. I wish you a long, happy life. I don't wish no ill on you. And you have a beautiful day. And please start to be nicer. Just enjoy your life. You, you're living in California, you know. Um, sun shining. You know, enjoy it. Enjoy the little moments, Susie. Don't sweat the small stuff. Love you. Have a good day.
Bye.